Good evening, everyone. Just now, a decision tonight on a proposed mosque in Oshkosh. It's been the controversial topic in that area. About 100 people turned out tonight at Oshkosh's City Hall. The council just a few minutes ago voting to approve the zoning to allow a Muslim group to open a mosque in a former funeral home on the city's west side, although the issue has become more than just about zoning. Fox 11's Lindsay Veramus live from Oshkosh tonight with balanced coverage. And Lindsay, what more do you have on the vote and the debate? Yeah, Tom, as you said, that decision came down just about 15 minutes ago. Now, we heard from many people tonight on both sides of the issue. Some say it's about religious freedom, others simply zoning. Now, the site on Eagle Street is across from West High School near Emmanuel Lutheran Church. The 45 member Ahmadiyya Muslim community wants to convert the site into a worship and community center. They're planning prayer five times a day, a Friday service, and other community events. However, property owners adjacent to the site have filed a petition in opposition. They say it's not about religion, rather a change in the neighborhood, bringing noise and traffic throughout the night. They say the funeral home was used minimally, while the mosque would have activity 16 to 18 hours a day, 365 days a year. We're not denying it. We're not saying it's wrong. But it really is a hardship for the neighbors. And again, if you're not a neighbor, it's not going to bother you that much. If I lived two blocks away, I probably wouldn't be here tonight. We have um, gone leaps and bounds. We have done so many things that other organizations may have never done. We did a public hearing. We talked about it. We talked to our neighbors. And whatever the outcome is today, we will still love our neighbors. The Muslim group is hoping to move into the new site in the next few weeks. We'll have a full report and reaction coming up on Good Day Wisconsin. Live in Oshkosh, Lindsay Vermis, Fox 11 News.